Hey, what is going on, people? Welcome back to yet another episode where we talk about best screen recorders and game recorders uh, for low end PC. I hope this video helps you out, so make sure to watch it till the end. And don't forget to leave your specs down in the comments below so I can reply to each one of you individually. And with all that said, let's get started. Alright, so the star of this video is Ease Us. Rec Experts. Isus is one of the most reputed company in the market with a lot of softwares in which one of their screen recorder software is also with us. And the best part is that it has AI functions in built as well. And there are a lot of things to cover in the screen recorder. So we're going to be going to each one of it down in this video. And I'm going to be showing you guys my personal opinion about this software as well as the usability and functionality and we're going to be rating this software on a scale of 1 to 10. So make sure to watch this video till the end and let's get started with the breakdown. Firstly, you can always click the link in the description below and download this screen recorder for completely free. Now, once again, I want to mention that this recorder is also available for completely free with just a single watermark. And if you want to get it removed, you can get a premium version. With that being clear, let's open up the software and have a look onto the UI. All right, so the first part is about the UI. The application interface is really, really simple. It's compact and easy to use for beginners. As you guys can see on the left hand side, we have all the features. On the right hand side, we have all of the functionalities right over here. So first, we're going to be talking about the record screen. That is the basic screen recorder. And over here, we can see two variants of it. First of which is the full screen recorder, as you guys can see at the orange border on all the sides of my windows. It is because I'm recording full screen currently. So setting it to regional and selecting this own bounds will help us to record the area inside this rectangle. You can see the aspect ratio and the resolution of this area. You can also click on it once again and reset it if you want. So this is pretty handy. And I mean, it's good for Chrome recording and all those things. However, it also offers you screenshot features as well as start and stop button right over here so you don't have to open the application every single time that is pretty cool and it also offers you multiple displays so if you have multiple display it works on that as well you can simply select the display from here and set the region and it will do the job now coming down to webcam yes you can record your webcam however i do not have one as of now but you can always click on the webcam and choose the webcam from here I have the EOS webcam utility, but my camera is not working right now. But you also have settings where you can set the uh, resolution over here. You can change the position. You can change the shape, opacity and everything here. Also, you have an option to record system sound as well as microphone sound. So for system sound, you can have the volume mixer. So that will open up the volume mixer of your PC and you can simply drag the volume of all of the applications. So you can match that perfect input that you're wanting. For the microphone, you can actually select record or do not record. However, the best part is that it has microphone boost for those mics which has low frequency and it also has a noise reduction feature. That means that if you have a very, very noisy background, you can always have it removed. And this is really strong in my opinion. You can always click on the advanced options and choose your microphone right from here. And as you guys can see, as you speak, the level should go up and down. This means that your microphone is working correctly. Second feature is the game recorder feature. And over here, if you open up any game and you can simply select the game from this window. Now, currently in this window, I only have my Chrome and browsers open up. But if you guys have a game running in the background, it will auto detect it and it will select the game over here. Also, you can select the game right over here then once again it offers you the same system microphone as well as the webcam recording feature however it also has a marking feature that means you can select a watermark for me i can use no watermark or i can use the mark one that is my logo my channel logo that will be appearing right on the bottom left however for now i'll just select no watermark or maybe i'll set it to watermark 
anything that can watermark my video. The enhanced mode is also really really helpful in certain things. However, we cannot discuss those things on the video, but you guys can always refer to the website for the more details of enhanced mode. And then it has the only recording webcam feature. Now let's come to the more basic things about the rec experts. Firstly, it has the file path. So you can select your file and store it anywhere you want. Uh, for the best settings, I'd recommend you guys to choose the output format to MP4. Quality, for me, I prefer high quality. But if you guys are running a very low end computer, you can go with standard. Then for frame rate, I have selected 144 FPS. Since this software allows you to record over 60 FPS, this gains a solid point right away. Now, the frame rate mode, it offers you variable and constant, but for better gameplay, I would recommend you guys to select constant frame rate. Then come out for audio and over here you'll find MP3. This is the one that is more standard and it is easier to edit. For bitrate, choose the maximum bitrate that is 256. It could be better, but it is the best among all of the category. For sampling rate, I set it to 44100 because that is the sampling rate for both my microphone and my headphones. Then here are some recording settings. Over here you can see the floating toolbar and everything you can set it according to your preference the most important part that i prefer to you guys is enable gpu hardware acceleration now this is the best part because if you are running a laptop or a desktop with multiple gpus this will use your gpu over your cpu and that will give you a lag free recording also you can select immediate play after the recording completes so once you are done with the recording it will open up a pop-up where you can always review your recording then it also offers you to personalize your hotkeys i have already done it for myself then you also have a feature to show your mouse cursor record your mouse clicks so anytime you click on the mouse it will make a red you know uh, the clicking over here you can set the color for me, I'll set it to red and then it also offers you a highlight effect. So wherever your mouse goes, it will carry this highlight around. However, if you're using it, just turn down the opacity just in case you want to see the background things that are behind the mouse because opacity 100 will simply make them not visible. Then coming down to game overlay information, I do not recommend you guys turning this on because it will be capturing everything in the video. But yep, you guys can turn it on if you want to. Lastly is the start. I have deselected launch at startup because I only want to start up this application whenever I want to record and not want to start up with a PC. This will help you keep your PC boot time optimized. However, Click on always run as administrator since this will help you guys to record your gameplays more efficiently and you guys won't face that black screen error if you try to record your games. Now once you're done with that, that is all for the best settings and I guess that all of the features of this screen recorder is covered right away. Also, it offers you a few more features which are very handy such as auto split. That means that it will split your file recording automatically. You can simply turn this thing on and you know, if you are clipping your live stream or if you're clipping anything, you can set it to, you know, let's say 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, it will split your recording file and you can you know choose this for one time or always i don't personally prefer to use auto split but if you guys want you can use it there is also auto stop feature which you can turn it on and you know set your recording time so you can always limit how much time it records i do not use it personally so i keep it off lastly is what are the results of course a lot of you guys might be wondering yeah i have talked a lot about the screen recorder but where are the results okay finally i will show you guys the thing that it is best on working is us reg experts how does it perform while recording my gameplay at 144 frame rates you'll find all of the files over here you can simply turn it on and here's the gameplay right on your screen now I'd like to mention you one more thing that you guys can clip a screenshot right from your recorded clip over here. It also offers you to set the playback speed or you can always select the volume. You can, you know, it has a quick edit function over here, which you can use to trim, compress, convert to constant frame rate. If you record it in variable ones, you can extract the audio out or you can, you know, just add an open or closing credits right before the video starts or ends. So yep guys, I think that Asus Rec Experts is quite professional, beginner friendly 
screen recording option and if you guys are new in the field and you want to record your gameplays at 144 hertz you guys can always do it with reg experts if your pc has just a little more power than usual now once again do leave your specs down in the comments below for best settings about this recorder however if you guys are really interested in getting this recorder you can always get it for free or you can always opt a subscription that will cost you monthly yearly lifetime or business plans very basic very user friendly and out of 10 i would give the screen recorder a solid 9 because it has very simple user interface to be honest and it is really easy to use now do leave your thoughts down in the comments below what you think about this recorder and are you planning to buy it if you want to get it i have left the links to it down in the description below go check out easy Tech experts see you guys in the next video until then stay tuned keep watching bear fox and peace out